Hey guys, welcome and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be giving you guys the makeup tutorial that you have all been asking me for. I know, I know, it's been forever since I've been saying I was going to do an updated makeup tutorial, but guys, I don't know, to be honest, I have no excuse, but yeah, here's the video, so let's just get started because yeah, hurry up. Okay, so I'm going to start off with my moisturizer. This is the moisturizer that I use. It's the La Roche posay one. Um, it does have SPF, but yeah. Okay, for primers, I use one of these three. Today, I'm going to go in with the ColourPop one because I'm not going to use these. But I normally use either one of these. But yeah. Also, guys, I'm doing this literally at 11 p.m. So if y'all hear any background noises or anything, I'm sorry. But just, yeah. I also do apply this all over my face. On my forehead and everything. Right after my moisturizer. Like, I let my moisturizer dry a little bit and then I go in with my... Primer. Okay, so for foundation, I'm gonna go in with the Femi foundation in the shade 105 using a flat brush like this. I bought these uh, um, on Amazon actually, a Hello Kitty packet on Amazon, and this brush came with it. And I just use this to apply my foundation. I only put a little bit. Well, I don't know how if you consider this a little bit or not, but I only put like a little drop on it, and then yeah, then I apply it on these areas. Just like that and i'm gonna go in with the damp beauty blender and i'm gonna just blend it all out i do blend them all the way down to my neck so make sure y'all blend down to your legs because girl then that don't be matching next i'm gonna go in with the nyx um contour stick in the shade universal light and i'm just gonna apply it in these areas and then my nose just a little because this is actually really pigmented so i apply it in these areas and then i use this brush i don't know this is a two-faced brush i don't know if they still sell it i have not seen anybody with it or anything but i just use like a hard brush like this i blend upwards all the way like just going upwards just like that always blend upwards because it just makes it look better and yeah so okay so i just blended out all my contour then i'm gonna go in with my juvia's liquid blush in the shade blush blush lily and i only put a little bit because this is really pigmented that's how much i put and that's the only places where i put it and then i go in with the l foundation brush and i blend it upwards just like that a little bit down actually because i just put it like on the cheek you know but yeah let me just blend this out Okay, and then I do add a little bit on my chin from like the excess after I blended this out. And I know it looks crazy, but just trust the process. Thank you. Okay, and for my concealers, I'm going to go in with the Born This Way concealer and the e.l.f. concealer in the shade Fair Rose and Marshmallow. And I apply this one, the lighter one, just in the inner corners. And then this one, I apply it everywhere, which I'll show y'all right now. Okay, so I'm applying my concealer right now. I put a little bit right there and then some right here. And that's all I put. Actually, no. I'm going to go in with this one now. I'm going to put this one just in the inner corner. And just a little bit just because I don't really... I stopped kind of liking the bright, bright under eye. And then I'm going to go in with a little bit of this one. And like just a little bit just to mix it together. Okay, and for my concealer, I'm going to go in with this brush. I got it from the TikTok shop. I'll have it tagged in one of my TikToks. So, yeah. But I'm just going to blend it all out. Just like this. And I do my under eyes last. I blend that out last. But I kind of like blend this in a little bit. And then I go in with the beauty blender and I blend over it. This was my first time using this um, concealer brush to blend out my concealer. And I actually think I like it. Like I'm literally going to start using it because what? It like blended out really good. Okay, not my under eyes because I'm not done with that. But everything else, like girl, what? I have it linked in my TikTok showcase and I will make a video about it too because yeah. So yeah, just go on my TikTok. I have it in my description down below. Okay, and before I blend out my under eyes with a beauty blender, I'm going to get my Fit Me, um, my Fit Me powder in the shade 05 Fair and then just a powder puff. And I'm going to like apply. Okay, like, I'm going to show y'all. So I grab a little bit. And then I like put it on the back of my hand and just like, you know, like that so it could be even or whatever. And then I'm going to go in with my beauty blender and blend out one side really fast. Actually, not really bad. Like, take your time, girl, because you don't want no creases, no nothing. And then make sure you have your powder puff ready. 
Okay, I don't look crazy, but just trust the process. And then right after, you're gonna go in with the powder puff and just put it under your eye. Okay, then I go ahead and grab like a little bit more powder and do the same thing. And I just apply it all over my face, literally everywhere. But like how my under eyes look, don't play, they look smooth. And then I do add a little bit just on my eyelids, just a little bit though, not too crazy because I don't want to apply no foundation, no concealer, nothing on there, but yeah. Okay, and then to add color back into my face, I'm going to go in with the Juvia's um, bronzer in the shade Light. And I'm going to go in with this one. And I use this brush from also a Hello Kitty thing. I bought it at TJ Maxx, I think. And then, you know, I just apply it right here, obviously. Just to add color back into your skin. And then on my forehead as well. I kind of like mix both, but like I mainly just use the bottom one. You can literally tell the difference that bronzer does. Like, it brings like so much color into your face. Like, girl, wait. And then I apply a little bit down here, just a little. And period. Then I go in with this one and like a little small fluffy brush, and I just do my nose contour. I'm using y'all as a mirror because I cannot use my mirror and do this at the same time. And I just do a little bit of nose contour or whatever. Nothing too much. And then I add a little bit on my eyelids, just a little. Not too much either. But you know, just like that and then like that. Okay, and then I'm going to go in with, again, the powder. And I'm going to just grab a lot more. And again, I'm going to just swipe it and clean it up down here. As well as this side. You know, just so I could have a little separation or whatever you want to call that girl. I don't know. And then we're going to do the same thing with my nose. We're just going to go all around. I mean, I don't really know how to explain this. Like, you just, just do what I'm doing, okay? Period. And then, um, actually, no, we're not in. Then we're going to do a little dot. Um, can you take a look at the missing nails, my girl? I'm going to glue that back on, good girl. No, thank you. Okay. And then once you look like this, then you're done. I'm just kidding. No, but okay. So then you're just going to let, I let the powder sit for like literally like 30 seconds, bro. But yeah, I'm going to go on with this fluffy brush and I'm just going to brush literally all the powder off everywhere. If you feel like your face looks a little pale, you can go ahead and add more bronzer. But on camera, I look really pale. Like I think it's the lighting, but in camera, I mean, in person, like I know I put a lot of bronzer, but... I'm gonna go in with my bronzer brush and I'm just gonna go over it a little bit. Just a little, not much. Now I'm gonna go in with my blush. This is a blush that I use, a Juvia's Blush Volume 4. I do put both of them. And again, I use another brush from the Hello Kitty brush set. And yeah, I use the bottom one and then a little bit of the top one because the top one is super pigmented. But yeah, let's just apply it. Blush is my favorite part, so I do go over, I put so much powder, like I literally, I mean, so much blush, because I love it, like, girl, way. So, yeah. I know it looks crazy, but just trust the process, everything's going to come together. And then I go in with my beauty blender, and I kind of just, like, you know, blend everything all together, everywhere. And then just like that. Your base is going to be basing because you're away. So this is the makeup. I'm going to do my lips right now, but this is like the base. Like, it's literally giving like my makeup. Okay, for my lip liner, I'm going to go in with the NYX in shade Nude Beige. I'm going to do this off camera though because I don't think I can do it on camera. Actually, let's try. But... Okay, and once I have my lip liner, sometimes I put lip gloss, sometimes I don't, but today I'm going to put lip gloss. So I use the e.l.f. one. This is my favorite one, the e.l.f. lip oil. That's literally the one I go to. And then, yeah. And this is in the shade Pink Quartz. And that's my lip combo. Okay, so this is the final makeup. This is what it came out to look like. It looks really good if you ask me, but... 
hopefully this helped you guys because i know a lot of y'all really really wanted this makeup tutorial so i hope this helped you guys and yeah this is the makeup anyways thank you guys so much for watching like comment and subscribe let me know what other videos i want to see because i know i have not been posting because i have no idea what to post anymore but let me know if y'all have any ideas and yeah and let me know if this makeup tutorial helped y'all because yeah and i kind of went in depth i tried going as much as i could but girl it's 11 at night like i'm trying to go to sleep but yeah thank you guys so much for watching i love you guys so much comment subscribe but yeah bye guys